Hey guys, what's going on? This is Travis. I'd like to welcome you back to Coffee, Computers, and More. And you know, on this channel, we test coffee and we test computers and we test a little bit of everything. Uh, today, we're going to show you something that might be tasty to have along with your cup of coffee. And uh, I try to support local business whenever I can. And recently, I had a friend give me a gift of some locally produced goods. And so we're going to be doing a kind of a four-in-one video taste test today. I'm going to sample a little bit of everything here. And the reason why I'm making this intro video is because we have family coming over and I'm worried this stuff's not going to last. So what we have here is the uh, Beatrice Bakery Company. And uh, you can go to BeatriceBakery.com and you can check out their entire catalog. They make premium, high-end artisan liqueur cakes, fruit cakes, coffee cakes, specialty cakes, you definitely need to check it out. They're actually a supplier to other brands and labels, and they're made right here in Nebraska, made in Beatrice, Nebraska, and uh, they do have a storefront you can go visit if you wanna buy some of their items. And so what we're gonna be sampling today is uh, chocolate rum cake. We're gonna have a little, little sliver of that one. Uh, we're also gonna have a little sample of some vanilla rum cake. And again, they make many different varieties, more than what you see right here. And we're also gonna have some turtle nut cake. And then finally, some chocolate-covered fruit and nut cake squares. Now, I had these without the chocolate last night. It was kind of a sample. And even if you don't like fruitcakes, to try a really good fruitcake, it can maybe change your mind. Now, obviously, if you don't like walnuts or pecans or whatever, then you're probably not going to be a fan or allergies. Everything I'm going to show you here is not gluten-free. It's not dairy-free. It's not nut-free, obviously. So allergies could be an issue for you. But they make some really interesting delicious looking pastries or desserts, and we're gonna try this. And so, we're not gonna pair it up with coffee, we're just gonna eat them as is, so it'll give you an idea what the flavor's like. Prices on it can vary a little bit. Um, I wanna say that the turtle nut cake is between, is either 13 or 15.95, I was just looking at the website earlier. And the vanilla rum cake and the chocolate rum cakes run 17.95, and they weigh, yeah, one pound each, so you're definitely getting a lot of dessert for the money. So we're gonna go ahead and crack these open, just sample each one and just let you know how they are. And like I said, I wanted to get these down before the family shows up so that uh, there's something left over. All right, let's go ahead and sample them and see how they are. All right, so the first sample we're gonna have here is the chocolate covered fruit and nut cake squares. Now here's what it says in the back of the box. We've got six individually wrapped decadent treats per box. Uh, grandma's Famous Fruit and Nut Cake Enrobed in Rich Milk Chocolate. And the Grandma's Famous brand or Grandma's Famous label or type is what the uh, Beatrice Baking Company is known for, bakery company is known for. Uh, cake contains walnuts, pecans, cherries, pineapple, raisins, and a batter enriched with bourbon, rum, and brandy. And uh, let's see, a confection worthy to carry the Beatrice Bakery Company name. All right, so let's take a bite and see how it is. It really just tastes like a candy bar. I mean, really. Mmm, it's really good. It all just kind of goes together. You're just getting kind of this, just this burst of nutty goodness. The chocolate is really good. Definitely sweet. I think one of these would probably be enough for anybody. Wait, okay. if you like chocolate, if you like fruitcake, or you just want to try something totally different, I think you'd like these. Um, If you like those turtle snacks, the turtles, a little car caramel, you know, walnut covered chocolate uh, confections, you'd probably like these too. Okay, so let's just take a look at the side profiles of these pastries before we enjoy these. Look at that, that vanilla rum cake right there. Try to get that in focus. Look at that. I think those layers, that's, that's the rum that they put in it. And my grandmother makes an absolutely fantastic rum cake that I wasn't allowed to eat until I was a teenager. So my, hand are, my, my standards are pretty high when it comes to rum cakes. There's the chocolate rum cake, obviously very dark but there's kind of a denser layer that's in there. And then look at the profile on this. This is the uh, the turtle nut cake. So when it comes to turtle, we're talking about uh, possibly chocolate, caramel, uh, walnuts, pecans, and so on. So we're gonna start off and go light. We're gonna go with the, the uh, vanilla rum cake, again, from the Beatrice Baking Company. Let's just see how it is. Oh, let's, yeah, let's go with it. Very moist, but not, not like trace leche soaked. Mm. Very distinct taste of rum. And I forgot to mention this on that fruit cake that I did that I tried with the chocolate on it. There was definitely that that back end of the rum that was in that too, because I believe that they put rum in those chocolate covered um, fruit cake slices that we just sampled. Let's take another bite. The vanilla is very mild also. Mm, mm hmm. Wow. That is that is a profoundly alcoholic cake. That is it's really good. All right, here, let's one more. Sorry guys, not overly sweet. You know, this would be really good. Just ready whip on top of it. 
maybe even like some cherries, uh, like, a, like a cherry pie filling or something. I don't know, you could do a lot with it. All right, let's go ahead and move over to the chocolate now. So we're gonna be looking for, are we looking for like a light chocolate taste or a dark chocolate taste? And also how is that rum aftertaste? And you really notice it with rum cakes, the back end when you start breathing, that's when you start to get that burn. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, traditional chocolate cake taste to it. Same moisture level. You know, the, uh, the chocolate is, is a little bit stronger and so it, it kind of covers up the taste of the rum a little bit, but it's definitely there. Nice and sweet. Oh man, it's good. So you guys definitely make sure you check out their website because they have a lot more varieties than what I'm showing off on the channel here, okay? All right, now finally the turtle nut cake. This thing is just packed, just packed full of nuts. Look at that, all right. Mm, okay, now that, that reminds me of that Sunday morning church fellowship hall coffee cake. Absolutely amazing. Oh wow, okay. The caramel flavor or the brown sugar flavor, very mild on the back end. Nuts have a nice toasting to them. Great stuff. Okay, I'm not kidding. These are all absolutely delicious, guys. I mean, maybe you've got your favorite places to go for rum cakes and things like that, but like I said, I had to tear into this now before my family gets to it. So Beatrice Bakery Company. Oh, you guys are hitting them out of the ballpark. You do a fantastic job. Maybe at some point, if I can, I could try to get a tour of the factory and show it off and talk about what you guys have to offer. But do check out the website. It's uh, BeatriceBakery.com. Okay, so definitely check it out. I'll put that web address on the screen for you and you guys can do that. But man, if you're a fan of the rum cakes, this is where it's at. So anyway, this is Travis. I want to thank you guys for watching Coffee Computers and more. Sorry to sit, <laughs> sorry to have you guys sit there and watch me dessert for the last five minutes, but this is so good. I want you guys to take, take care, have fun, be safe. Uh, we'll be bringing you a lot more coffee reviews in the future. And as you know, we will talk to you soon. All right, take care. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. Oh my God, this job is so hard.